Who here has ever had the experience of really being into somebody and they don't care quite the same for you? Yeah, who has had that experience of you're, you're kind of gaga for somebody and it's not entirely reciprocated? Yeah, that, yeah that's completely real, that's completely human. As I say, you've been Ava Brond. <laughs> to explain what I mean. Ava Braun was a 20th century German photographer, first half of the 20th century. Uh, best known for, in 1935, she did a photo shoot with a German politician named Adolf Hitler, and after that photo shoot, they became a couple, and remained a couple for the rest of their lives. Now here's the crazy detail which you need to know about Ava Braun for this song. Nobody knew about Ava Braun until after the war. It was a complete secret from the German people until 1945. Now who here has ever had the experience of somebody being really into you and you not exactly reciprocating? Yeah, that's completely real. That's completely real. That's completely honest. Love can be a battlefield. Love can be a battleground. And it's not your fault. You're not doing anything wrong. You're not stringing them along. Maybe you're being completely honest about what's going on. But you just don't feel entirely the same. That's okay, right? We've all been there. As I like to say, you're just being a little bit of an Adolf Hitler. <laughs> So, the only time they were ever seen in public together was the 1936 Olympics in Berlin. Otherwise, she was kept a secret, so he would be more desirous like a boy again. And he did love her. He does say in his writings that Ms. Braun is, besides my, Ms. Braun is, besides my dog Blondie, the only person I can trust in this world. So, that's love. He trusted her. <laughs> and he cared for her. But, how would you like it if you had kept in the shadows for ten years, right? That's a long time. And say what you want about Hitler, he was definitely a public personality. Now, the difference between us and ISIS is we believe in love, right? That's the difference between us and our enemies, is no matter how dark it might seem, no matter what you think, if you were to say, somebody doesn't deserve love, I say to you, madam, you sir, need to look inside you at your own sort of morals, your own sort of feelings, because everybody is deserving of love. That's the difference between us and them, whoever us is and whoever them are. And it's in honor of that that I've written a song. Because say what you want about the politics of Ava Braun, and as a Jew, I obviously have a lot of feelings about the politics of Ava Braun. But this isn't about her politics. This is about her heart. This is about her heart, which was played with for a little while. And which, well, I hope that none of us have fallen upon us what happened to her. Ava Braun never let on what was going on in her mind when she posed to Adolf. Catches your eye across the subway, and he decides to have the balls, to have the ovaries, to 
go up to them and say something. True love can even come the day before your joint suicide pact when the Russians take over your bunker. Because <laughs> like I said, true love is weird. And indeed, it's true. The day before they have a joint suicide pact, they finally get married. It finally happens. It's kind of beautiful. This is historical fact. The marriage certificate actually did survive. We do see that on her marriage certificate, she signs it A of B, crosses out the B, and then writes Hitler. She was finally, after all those years, she was finally Ava Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. Ava! <laughs>